So what we're doing right here is just having them um, back pedal deceleration working on uh, deceleration mechanics. Alex, let's see! Explosive, Finny! Now we're just having them shuffle step through, just working on accelerating, cutting, working on shuffle mechanics. Hey, ne touche pas le pied! Écarte le pied! So we're just having them keep their feet wide, shuffle step, working on trying not to cross over their feet to accelerate and uh, do agility stuff. With limited uh, equipment, so sometimes we have to use par partners. And we're just working on um, resisted sprints, acceleration starts. So this is how we do it right here. We have them just hold the partner, have them drive through, and finish it with the acceleration. Just like that. So here's a, one of our athletes right here. So the athlete protect the scapula, and then bring it back. Just like that. Nice and controlled. So now I got one of my athletes, he's a new power cleaner, so we're going to work on his technique. Um, I have them usually roll their wrists back, keep their arms locked to try not to use their arms, and keep the bar close to their body. It's their body that moves around the bar, not the other way around. Okay? Hey, they fini avec le tie, okay? Finish with the hips, finish with the hips, extension. Voila, Sam Pomeyer. Hey, exacto, il faut fini et fais ça. Ça, so we got it. Pa, allez. Voila. He's working on good form, running mechanics, keeping that toe up. Those hips extended, using the hip flexor to drive. So now we got some adduction going on, adduction going on. Hip adduction, just working on coordination of the body and hip flexors running. Got some stabilization going on here. Stabilization exercises. We got here. Four, 
Go a little bit slower on the way up. Control it. Control it. There we go. I'm going to show you uh, the, the stability ball rollout. So what you want to do is keep your hips straight. Okay? Kind of bring your, bring, bring your stomach to your spine. Okay? You want to lay with your hips and fall. Just like that. And control it. Okay? Break your hips like that. You want to keep them straight. Just like that. Okay? Okay. Voila. Like that. Okay. Show me. There we go. Every time my athletes come in, I have them go through foam roll. We do medicine balls here just because we're on low budget. We don't have foam rolls. So just have to go through and work out anything that's tired or sore. Um, anything that I feel is it up, work on that, try to get it out and then we'll stretching after. Have them space their hands out 14 inches. Keep their body contracted, don't rotate the torso. Try to keep their shoulders uh, scapular scap scap retracted. When they're doing this exercise. Alright, so you want to do that for 15 seconds. Just like that. Okay. Keep your hands out. Sport specific kind of conditioning. Uh, we're just going to work on technique of cutting. So, what I'm going to have my athlete do is he's going to start here, okay? You have a ball, you can. I'm going to finish off, he's a DB, so I'm going to finish off with him cutting and going and get the ball. We're going to run three times in the five yard span right here. We're just going to work on getting our toe pointed in the other direction that we want to go, accelerate really fast. So, we're going to work on that change of direction cut. Okay, today's just 60% to start out, and whenever he cuts out, he's going to go get the ball. But not any. So if you're Finney, if he lost the ball, he's going to go slow. Okay? Wait. Set. Hit. Turn in the toe. Turn in the toe. Turn in the feet. Turn in the feet. C'est bon. C'est bon. Allez, allez. C'est bon. So now what we're doing is just developing a little bit of explosion through the rotation. So I'm just having my athletes turn and hit the uh, the bag with the with the dummy pad. Explosive! Puissant! 